Our Sunday conversation this morning is with a member of one of Houston's most prominent families, the McNairs, a name synonymous with the Texans and community service. Hannah McNair is married to Cal McNair, son of the late Bob McNair, an integral part of the McNairs' continued legacy. Hannah plays a major role in the family's philanthropic work. She talks more about that, the Texans and her late father-in-law in this Sunday conversation with our Christine Noel. Okay, so you're this wonderful mom, wife. I personally think a fashionista. Oh, you're super thank you. active in the nonprofit world. How do you juggle it all? Um, I have a very supportive family, and uh, we definitely make time. Well, let me see. We. I don't know how I do it. I actually don't know <laughs> because every day is different and I don't know because if you have a sick child, it, you know, your whole day changes and you got to figure it all out. I really can't tell you how I do it. <laughs> is it literally like a one day at a time, yes. pivoting, yes. navigating, yes. and continuing to move forward? Yes, but I will say that I always make family my priority. If we can, I'd love to talk about Bob for a second. I know uh, late last year you lost your father-in-law and really the city of Houston lost Bob over the years of your time with him and your husband's time with him what is the one thing that you feel like he left with you that really inspires you both to continue giving back and being so uh, so close to the community you can't go wrong by doing what's right and he laid the foundation early on uh, with the organization and with his family, for Cal, from a young age. And then when I came into the family is, you really can't go wrong by doing what's right. No matter the pressure that's on you, you always do the right thing. And he always instilled in everybody that you need to give back to the community. And that has stuck with all of us. I and mean, he laid that foundation. You feel like that's even more so true now that he's passed? Yes, we're, we have the responsibility to continue that on, that legacy that he's left us with that we want to continue on. And the Houston Texans Foundation is really um, involved with a lot of charities and gives to a lot of charities. And a lot of times we see the players showing up to these events. That community involvement, involvement for the players, what do you think that does for them as, as a team and as individuals? Well, when anybody gives back and does something good, it makes you feel better. If you're having a bad day and then you do something good for somebody else, all of a sudden your day is much better. And so when you can do that throughout the entire organization, they feel better. They love to do it. It's not hard to get them to go out into the community and to make a difference in the future lives of these children because it makes them feel better and they know that they're doing something good for the future generations. And a lot of times you see like these big tough guys, you know, and we see, we see the work that they they're, do on the field yes. and then here they are in front of these little kids and it's almost like sometimes they turn to mush, right? Yes. Yes. Do you have, was there ever a moment where you saw like one of the players and you were like, oh my gosh, like look at him with that little one. All of them. Yeah. They're all so good with the kids. And I think they'd rather be with the kids than any of the adults. <laughs> so it really, they it always turns me to much just watching them. And you get new players in every year. And every time, they're just so sweet with the children. And I, I think that they connect with them because sometimes they can see themselves in these young children that maybe they're from a community that is hard and they want to help them so they're paying it forward how it was given to them and they're gonna make a difference in these children and lives. I'm sure for for you and your family like sort of seeing that full circle I'm assuming that pr presumably football is king in the McNair household <laughs> and I'm sure that maybe in some cases these players become sort of like part of your family yes everybody in that organization is a part of our family um, when you come in, when you leave, I mean, we're all a big family. You really are.